Breaking news, America's new sixth generation stealth fighter will be built by Boeing. It's already been flying in some capacity for the past five years and is called the F-47. Now we only got a tiny glimpse of what this new fighter looks like in this image here, and other than that we are left to our imaginations. But this fighter emerged out of the Air Force's Next Generation Air Dominance Program, which has roots that date back to a classified 2014 study entitled the Dominance Initiative, which set out to determine the technologies required to maintain America's air dominance for decades to come. Now, the need for a new stealth fighter to replace the F-22 in the air superiority role became evident in recent years not because of the Raptor's capability set, which is still mostly regarded as the best in the world, but because of its curtailed production. With only 150 combat-coded F-22s in existence and no means to build any more, any Raptor lost in combat or that just ages out of service can't be replaced. Now that classified report then rolled over into a classified X-Plane program that saw participation from the Air Force, the Navy, and DARPA, which was meant to demonstrate the capabilities laid out in that report, chief among them being improved all-aspect stealth, even greater degrees of sensor fusion, and most importantly, operating as a, quote, family of systems, meaning these new fighters are designed to operate alongside AI-enabled drone wingmen, like those being developed in the Air Force's ongoing Collaborative Combat Aircraft Program. Just recently, two drones were given actual drone fighter designations, the General Atomics FQ-42 and the Andoral FQ-44, which will be the air-to-air -air combat drones that will fly alongside this new fighter. And this X-Plane, dubbed Next Generation Air Dominance, proved so successful that it became the basis for both the Air Force and the Navy's separate but parallel sixth generation fighter programs. Now, Boeing is a bit of a surprise choice for this contract. Initially, it came down to Boeing, Lockheed Martin, and Northrop Grumman, but after Northrop backed out with the promise of focusing on the Navy's new fighter effort, Many sort of assumed that this competition was Lockheed's to lose. Boeing, of course, has faced several controversies and big scandals in recent years, from problems with their commercial aircraft to continued setbacks with their KC-46 refueler. But it is worth noting that Boeing has a longer history of stealth aviation development than literally any other firm on the planet, dating all the way back to the early 1960s with their Model 853-21 Quiet Bird, extending into the 1990s after their merger with McDonnell Douglas, where they fielded the formerly classified YF-118G Bird of Prey, and then into the 2000s, where Boeing competed and lost for the Joint Strike Fighter contract with their relatively derpy-looking X-32. Of course, it's also important to remember that regardless of who designs this fighter, there will be many contractors involved in its production, which will almost certainly also include both Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman.